There are dozens of projects going on right now in Virginia Beach to help prevent flooding. We're getting an update on what they are and what they cost. Janet Roach joins us now with a breakdown of the city's flood protection plan. Dana, there are seven master projects in the works estimated to cost almost a billion dollars. Beyond that, dozens of stormwater projects are ongoing. We're talking about drainage work, lake dredging, pump station repair and more. Take dredging, for instance, dredge the lakes. They don't overflow. A $40 million grant from the American Rescue Plan Act will pick up part of that $21.3 million cost. That's just a drop in a bucket. Other funding sources include the bond referendum, and the capital improvement plan. A project engineer showed council the millions of dollars of improvements going on district by district. Councilwoman Barbara Henley spoke about challenges in District 2. Because it's been flooded all weekend, of course, I, I made the mistake of hoping it had gone down some when I came over here and went through some pretty high water. Um, but it's not going any place until the wind shifts. And and that district includes Pungo Ferry at Back Bay. The most money is earmarked for District 3 at $267 million. That includes Windsor Woods and Princess Anne Plaza. Janet Roach, 13 News Now. Thanks, Janet.